we want to solve the given equation. The first step in solving the equation is to simplify both sides of the equation, which means we clear the parentheses by distributing and then combine like terms. On the left side, we distribute three to clear the parentheses. On the right side, we distribute four to clear the parentheses. Three times six x is eighteen x. And then three times negative two is negative six, giving us minus six. And then we still have plus eleven equals, on the right side, four times five x is twenty x. And then four times negative five is negative twenty, giving us minus twenty. And then we still have plus three. And now we simplify both sides by combining like terms. Notice on the left side we have two constant terms, and we also have two constant terms on the right. So on the left, negative six plus eleven is positive five, and therefore the left side simplifies to eighteen x plus five. Equals on the right side, negative twenty plus three is negative seventeen. The right side simplifies to twenty x minus seventeen. The next step is to add or subtract to isolate the variable terms on one side. Notice right now we have eighteen x on the left and twenty x on the right. To get the variable terms on one side, we need to either subtract twenty x on both sides or subtract eighteen x on both sides. Let's have the variable term be on the left, and therefore we will subtract twenty x on both sides. Simplifying eighteen x minus twenty x is negative two x. The left side simplifies to negative two x plus five. On the right side, twenty x minus twenty x is zero, which is why we subtracted twenty x on both sides. The right side is now just negative seventeen. Again, we still have not isolated the variable term. To isolate negative two x, we need to undo the plus five by subtracting five on both sides. Simplifying, on the left, five minus five is zero, which is why we subtracted five on both sides. The left side is now negative two x equals on the right side, negative seventeen minus five is negative twenty-two. Now that we've isolated the variable term on the left side, the next step is to multiply or divide to isolate the variable. Because negative two x means negative two times x, to isolate x and undo the multiplication, the next step is to divide both sides by negative two. Simplifying, negative two divided by negative two simplifies to one. One times x is x, x equals. On the right side, negative twenty-two divided by negative two is positive eleven. The solution is x equals eleven. And let's go ahead and check our solution. To check the solution, we will now substitute eleven back into the original equation. Performing the substitution gives us three times the quantity six x minus two would be six times eleven minus two, and then we have plus eleven equals on the right side four times the quantity five x minus five is five times eleven minus five, and then plus three. And now simplifying inside the parentheses, six times eleven is sixty-six. Sixty-six minus two is sixty-four. This gives us three times sixty-four plus eleven equals on the right side. Five times eleven is fifty-five minus five is fifty, giving us four times fifty plus three. Back on the left, three times sixty-four is one hundred ninety-two, and we still have plus eleven. On the right side, four times fifty is two hundred, giving us two hundred plus three. One hundred ninety-two plus eleven is two hundred three, and two hundred plus three is also two hundred three. Verifying the solution is correct. I hope you found this helpful.